a medicine capsule is in the shape of cylinder with two hemispheres stuck to each of its end okay so we have a capsule which is in the shape of cylinder and on either end we have hemispheres stuck to it so this is our capsule right the length of the capsule is 14 okay this total length is 14 mm and width is 5 mm so this width is 5 mm right that means the diameter of the hemisphere is given 5 mm right so radius of the hemisphere will be half of that which, which will be equal to 2.5 mm find its surface area we need to find the surface area of this uh, capsule all right so which means we need to find the curved surface area of one hemisphere and then curved surface area of cylinder and then curved surface area of the other uh, hemisphere isn't it so this is csa of hemisphere plus csa of cylinder plus csa of hemisphere again right so can we write two times csa of hemisphere yes csa of hemisphere csa of hemisphere these two hemispheres are of same size right that means it will be csa of sphere okay now csa of cylinder here so this is 2 into what is csa of hemisphere it is 2 pi r square plus csa of cylinder 2 pi r h so this will give us 4 pi r square plus 2 pi r h right okay now what can we take common 2 pi r we can take common right if we take 2 pi r here 2 r and here um, h will be common okay so let us substitute the values now so uh, what is the radius 2 pi 2 into 3.14 is pi radius 2.5 right so it is 2.5 2 into 2.5 plus h what is h here see h is height of the cylinder this is cylinder only right 2 pi r h so h is height of the cylinder so from here to here the capsule was 14 mm so this radius is equal to how much it is 5 and this radius sorry 2.5 right 2.5 2.5 so we need to subtract this radius and this radius from 14 so 14 minus 2.5 plus 2.5 so 14 minus 5 it will give us how much 9 so the length of the cylinder from here to here it is equal to how much 9 so h is equal to how much here 9 in our case right so 2 into 2.5 will give us 5 5 into 3.14 into 5 plus 9 so 5 into 3.14 into 14 okay so this will give us 220 it is in mm so it is mm square all right see if we substitute pi as 22 by 7 will get 220 but if we substitute pi as 3.14 will get 219.8 so 220 219.8 both are approximately same right so if we substitute 22 by 7 will get 220 and if we substitute 3.14 will have 219.8 okay